Hi friends, how are you guys? I've missed you guys so much and I'm so excited to be able to teach you art again this year. It's a new year and it got me thinking, what can we do at home that's different than what we've been doing? So we've been doing a lot of drawing and exploring and learning about our concepts, but I wanted to try to do something a little bit different until we hopefully come back to school. So let's talk about something called recycled art, okay? And I'm going to share my screen and we are going to go over some different artists who do recycled art and I hope it gives you guys some inspiration on what to do for our project today. So let me remember how to share my screen. All right, so you should be able to see my screen now and here we go. So this says recycled art. And in this picture, I see a tree, right? So I see a tree, but what is this tree made out of? If you kind of zoom in and look closely, paint cans, metal cans, big pieces of metal, um, it's all made out of recycled materials. So when I say recycled, I mean, you take something that has one use, like let's say this pen, and you give it another use when you're done with it. Or for example, this little piece of paper that I have right here. I can take it, turn it into something else. That's what recycling is. And recycling is super important for our environment so we don't create lots of trash in our world. Here's another one that I really, really like. So this one is just pieces of junk and metal. But when you take a flashlight and hold it on this side over here and shine it up against the wall, it looks like two people sitting on a stool. How crazy is that? That the shadow is the art. Now these are super interesting to me. So this is recycled clothing and they separated it by color and then made a rainbow out of it. I just thought that was so cool that um, they kind of made this tunnel out of recycled art clothes. So I just, I love this one. I love that they use the rubber boots and they made all of these clothes into an artwork. Here's another one. So they use trash bags, plastic trash bags to make, it looks like a person kind of for their artwork, maybe like a ghost. And this one's super cool. You guys might know who this is. This is Michael Jackson. And they used, um, this is like a little tape. And then here they use the ribbon all for the hair and made the hair out of that. So what other materials can we use to create recycled art? So we could use scrap paper, plastic bags, or a cardboard box. I know some of you might have lots of cardboard boxes at home that you could ask to use. Um, pieces of trash, now don't do anything crazy, like don't get anything gross. Clothing, don't ruin them, right? You still gotta wear them. Um, your toys, shadows, like that one artist, um, plastic from the toys. So like the wrapper of things, when it comes in something, you could use it for something else. Paper plates, cups. Now what else can you guys think of for recycling? And what are these artworks considered? Well, we would consider this a collage if we're putting little scraps of paper together. Installation art and sculpture. So sculpture is a big one when we talk about recycle art. That's what we see a lot, like that giant tree that is a sculpture. It's grand, it's big, but collage is another form of recycling. Maybe little small scraps of paper and turning it into something else. Okay, so for our project today, this is what I want you to do. Now I'm gonna attach a couple of videos about recycling and how to draw the recycling symbol. Um, in the meantime, what I want you to do is I want you to find things around your house. And I've just shown some examples. So I had some chocolate earlier and I just, I love this wrapper. See how it's shiny on one side and it has like little flowers. So what could you turn this into? You can fold it. You can make it look like a flower maybe, fold it up. Attach it to something, make it wearable like jewelry or there's so much you could do with that. With all of your scraps, um, these are just like the edge of a notebook. 
this. See, these little scraps of paper. Um, and when you fold them, you can kind of make different things. So I mean, this one kind of looked like a, like a little, a little like a centipede or a little lizard. So I kind of drew it and folded the legs. So you can kind of see. I thought that was really fun. Or you could take a picture of something. So let's say you lay all your, some of your clothes out on the floor. Now don't make a mess. I don't want anybody's families to be mad at me. And um, you arrange them by color and make a rainbow. Or you do that with your toys. That would be the same thing, right? You're using it for another purpose. So I would love for you to send me a picture of something that you made out of recycled materials, okay? Now you can add things like paint or drawing to all these things too. So don't forget that. Now, recycled art is really important and I'm really excited to see what you guys do. Now remember, don't do anything you're not supposed to do or that's unsafe. And make sure you have permission before you recycle any of the materials, okay? Now, I hope you have a great rest of your week and I can't wait to see what you guys make. Don't forget to upload to Seesaw, okay? Bye guys.